Oops. Yes, what's your question? I have two questions, if you don't mind me asking. Okay. Uh, Are they short? Yeah. No pun intended. What? <laughs> what? I meant duration, not yeah. height. Okay. Uh, I can't even say the word short anymore. Can you believe that? Isn't that sad? Anytime I say I have a short story, everyone goes, <laughs> he said short. So. I have a truncated story. <laughs> Okay, so first of all, for those, oh God, <laughs> for those kids who, like my age, who have big dreams of becoming voice actors, and especially the ones that uh, voice act a lot, um, what do you have? What do you say about? What do you have to say about them? And what are tips you can give them? Well, I will tell you. You would, you would want me to be honest with you, wouldn't you? Yes. You wouldn't want me to tell you something that wasn't true or sugarcoat something. So I will be honest with you. When I started voice acting. It was a very small industry. Uh, it, it wasn't that hard to get into because it was just getting off the ground and they were looking for actors and I was very blessed, and I use that term on purpose, very blessed to get the opportunity to go and audition for this tiny little place in, in uh, Houston called ADV Films. Uh, I mean, it was small, you guys, like you could put it on the stage. It was just a little studio where these guys that love anime wanted to dub it into English. So I, uh, I went there and auditioned and I got cast and, and I just kept getting cast in, in more and more shows. It was pure gift. Now the big thing was though that I had a lot of experience in acting. See that's the, that's the thing is that I was all, had already spent many years developing skills that 